What's up, everybody? We're at the historic Loveland Castle here in Loveland, Ohio. It's right where I grew up. Grew up about 10 minutes away from here. Just a quick 10 minute walk through the woods. And uh, so yeah, we're here and uh, here with Rhea. And I wanted to give you guys a little walking tour of my favorite little place, Sir Fred right there. That's right. All right, so this, uh, this castle was built by Sir Harry Andrews. He was, uh, he's a World War I veteran. Uh, he was stationed um, in France, about 50 miles east of, uh, of Paris. And uh, when he was in World War I, he was staying at what they called the Chateau de la Roche, and he wanted to build a castle when he got back to his hometown, which is here in Loveland. And so he uh, had a degree in medieval architecture and he drew this, he built up, did the blueprints for this whole castle. And um, he actually left the blueprints in France. And so he ended up building this whole thing by memory. Each stone that you see here came from the Little Miami River, which is the river right down there. That's where I grew up. And uh, yeah, every single day from 1929 to 1981 when he passed, he used to get uh, five, two five-gallon buckets and he would carry all these stones. Oh, okay, baby, let's go inside here real quick. And he would get all these, um, he basically built this whole castle. So we're gonna do a little walking tour inside. This is Sir Harry Andrews here, just an amazing man. This young, this picture of him later in life right there. There he is. All right, let's go up in here. These are the, the stairwells. He did circular stairs, um, really skinny stairs so you cannot s swing, can't uh, shoot an arrow or swing a sword in the, in the stairs. So he did a lot of defense um, mechanisms in this castle because uh, you can never be too safe. So here's his room right here. A lot of architects of the day said you couldn't build, I guess that's called a rotunda, but you couldn't build a rotunda, um, a spherical roof right there. And the old man was like stubborn, you know, and he said, obviously, yeah, he can. And so he built it under his room and he sleeps under it every single, he slept under it every single night. So this is Sir Harry Andrews' room. It's the main dining area right here. We're going in here and Ray has got a little toy airplane. That's what that sound is. But um, we're gonna go out here to the, the balcony. And so he just, Sir Harry Andrews just built this thing. He's gonna work on it every single day until the day he died. So it wasn't gonna ever be a complete castle. Um, and you have right here, the KOGT, which stands for the Knights of the Golden Trail. Uh, the Golden Trail is what, on the opposite end of that river over there, uh, there's the, the, the bike trail, that Little Miami bike trail that goes, um, all, goes most of it. Um, but before it was the, before it was the, uh, before it was the, the bike trail, it was uh, the old b &O Railroad. And before that, it was part of the Underground Railroad. So, um, you know, people who were seeking freedom, I would take that. And uh, that's kind of what the KOGT is. So this is some of the rooms right here. He's got a little chapel in here, which the Knights just continue to work on it. Those guys, these guys are just amazing guys. So he built, he put the uh, 10 commandments right here inside the castle. And he uh, led some Bible studies. He was a, I believe he was also a, um, a minister as well. <laughs> What's that, baby? Oh, no, okay. Hey, let's go look this way. No? All right, I don't know how much time I'm going to have. Ray is getting a little upset, but uh, I love the doors, too. They make it so that no two pieces of grain are going the same direction, and that just is a defense mechanism to make sure that people can't bust down the doors because uh, Sir Harry Andrews, the old man, used to you know, have to deal with some punks in the neighborhood that would come in and hold you. Okay, baby, I'll hold you. Oh, little, 
Okay, let's go this way. Oh, look at the nights over here. All right, we're gonna go, I'm not gonna go up to the roof because it's closed right now, but we're gonna go back down. Let's go back down and to here. We're gonna go outside. We're not gonna go in the dungeon either because the dungeon's a little creepy. But uh, there's a glory right there. I'm gonna go this way here. This is my favorite spot. Katie and I got, oh, whoa, they added this. Oh, they opened up this room. That's kind of cool. This is new. <sighs> Katie and I got married here. Had our first kiss here. And uh, yeah, it's just such a really special place to me. We're gonna go back here into the garden. I mean, it's just an amazing place, especially as a kid growing up, right? You're like, got this little castle right here. So here's the garden area. The knights just keep this place immaculate. This is the stage. This is where I'm gonna be playing next week. And, uh, oh yeah, there's also a little bomb shelter here too as well. Sir Harry Andrews knew that, you know, in the case of a uh, nuclear fallout, he built a, <clears throat> he built a, a, a fallout shelter underneath. I can't remember where it is. It's somewhere over here. I think it might be right over here. But you could, you could literally stay in the bomb shelter for like a couple months. But it's uh, if you needed. So there's a castle there. And uh, just what an amazing place. So, uh oh. Okay, well, let's say bye bye. All right. So, uh, the show, Saturday, May 22nd, um, here at the Loveland Castle. If you want to get tickets, it's uh, you have to go to www.lovelandcastle.eventbrite.com. Uh, we have, uh, I think, 147 tickets sold right now, so we're getting close to being sold out. So if anybody wants to come to the, uh, come to the castle, you got to make sure you get your tickets. And um, you also got to get a parking pass because we're located in the, in the valley, right? So there's not uh, really any parking down here. Um, you can't really park in the neighborhood or down on the streets. So, um, yeah, so if you're not going to be Ubering, hey, baby. If you're not going to be Ubering or taking a lift, uh, make sure you get tickets. Hey, baby, let's come this way. Ugh. And, uh, yeah, I hope everybody's doing well wherever you are. And uh, I hope if you're in Cincinnati, I hope to see you on May 22nd here at the Loveland Castle. We have an awesome show planned, and we uh, just love you all for all the amazing support. And hope you have a great day wherever you are. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye.